Neighbors who live on Irving Street say their quality of life has gone downhill over the last three years due to an increase in drug activity. Police have told residents not to interact with loiterers and to instead call them. But thanks to a recent interaction caught on camera, it's forcing residents to question whose side the police are on. I'm not driving by to harass you. Yeah. I'm driving by to send you over here. Caught on camera, this interaction over the summer, a Hartford police officer responded to a resident concern of loitering on Irving Street. Someone around here is a snitch. And yeah. You guys are just hanging out. How do you say there are snitches on the street? In fact, you told them you didn't really want to be there. Irving Street resident Hortense Ross told Fox 61, not only is the term snitch unprofessional. Who are you protecting? but irresponsible and dangerous. You put a target on my back. Irving Street residents say loitering is just one of the neighborhood's many problems. <laughs> Illicit activities range from littering to indecent exposure, deadly stabbings. It looked like it was clearly targeted. And shootings. She was home, that was her yard, that's where she lived. But it wasn't always that way. We took pride in that neighborhood. Precious Rosellis and her family moved to Hartford from Jamaica in the 70s. Back then, Irving Street was a thriving community with an active police substation and place for kids to play. It's just the violence. It takes over. Too many people drop dead at that corner right there. And people would come and say, Precious, is that your street again? Pastor A.J. Johnson of the Center for Leadership and Justice says requests for mediation have not been productive. That isn't what we expect out of our police department. We just want that simple level of accountability. Both Precious and Hortense say they feel vilified and abandoned, but are hopeful. I am trusting that there can be a change. Refusing to give up on the city they call home. My friends move out of Hartford. They said, Precious, when are you going to move out of Hartford? I said, I'm not leaving Hartford. I love Hartford. I see the opportunity. I reached out to the Hartford Police Department, but they declined to comment on this story. An internal affairs investigation and police civilian review board complaint are underway into the incident involving the officer in the video. Reporting in Hartford, Matt Karen, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.